Hello guys, welcome to Filament Daily. This week on the channel we're showcasing the filament examples from our new project filamentexamples.com and topic of today is custom fields. Pretty similar to what WordPress does if you want to add custom fields to the blog. So we created our own demo to create a customer with custom fields. So for example, you want to create a customer like CRM or something, and then you don't really know what other custom fields will there be. So name, email, and phone is kind of a known required list, but then additional what? For example, field type, address, age, phone number, nationality, or whatever you want. So you provide the address with something, you add another field, field type, for example, emergency, contact something, and then you create the customer and those fields are still here, which you can edit or remove, for example, and then save changes. And then in the database, it is saved if we refresh the customer table and then there's customer field with customer ID and field ID with the value that we provide. So how does it work in the code? First, on eloquent level, in the customer model, we define customer fields relationship. And then we can provide a repeater field in the filament resource. So in the form of the customer, there's schema section make for main customer details. And then additional information is with repeater make. Repeater with relationship of that relationship name customer fields and then the schema of that repeater. Repeater, by the way, means what it actually is named, repeating fields. And each of those fields have schema with a few more tricks here. So the schema is select and value with text input, and that select comes from the relationship. So field is a separate database table with name and ID. And then there are two extra kind of things, disable option when and live. Live means whenever you choose a field, it refreshes the form and refreshes the form with the purpose of disabling the same custom field from being chosen twice. So not sure if you noticed, but if I add another field, I cannot choose address anymore. It is disabled. So this is done by disabled option when we get all the fields in the collection by dollar get and then we reject the ones that contain the value. A bit of Laravel collection magic with live wire and filament magic. So yeah, this is how we implemented custom fields. If you want the full source, I will link that project in the description below and you can access all the examples for $99. It's a one-time purchase. At the time of shooting this video, there are 24 examples, but I already see the list of upcoming like five or 10 examples just in upcoming weeks. And you would get all of those for free if you subscribe. So you get the access to the repository for all the future updates and new projects within the same price of $99. Tomorrow I will review one more filament example, which will showcase a few more filament tips. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.